What is up guys, today I'm going to show you how to do a Twitch effect in After Effects, Adobe After Effects. Well anyways, what you want to do first is you want to open up Adobe After Effects, Composition, New Composition or Control N, and let's just make this Twitch, Twitch, Tut, alright. And you want to make your settings, whatever whatever one you want to do and then let's say you just want to put a video in so you want to right click um, file import and just look for a video that you want to put in so let me just see um, I'll just put my old my old edit in and then once you have it here I want to drag it to the timeline Okay, now line that up. Let's line this up real quick. Sounds like something's speeding outside. All right, I'm not gonna make it perfect, but I mean, once you have yours nice and neat or whatever you want to do, you're gonna want to make sure you have this clicked on. You want to go to Effect, Video Copilot, Twitch and I like to work down here it's easier thanks to Irish Sniper he helped me with this so I think it's easier too so you wanna go to effects twitch you're gonna wanna make this zero well if you can go anywhere you want I'm gonna go right there and you're gonna wanna make this zero and then keyframe it and then go up another keyframe and then go to enable slide on lights on and then click the little stopwatch things go to operator controls and then go to slide and then it should say slide RGB split but it says slide R dot dot, dot split and then make that to 100 but you can change it if you want it to be a really small twitch and like 20 maybe and then so you now you're gonna want to go to your amount and then make that go up. You see, it starts doing the twitch. I'm just gonna do, let's see, 25. All right, see back here, it doesn't do the twitch, but right when it hits the keyframe, it starts switching. Now, let me see if I can render a preview for this guy for y'all. I'm gonna pause the video because it might take longer and I'm gonna get back to you whenever it finishes. Alright, so pretty much this is what it's gonna look like. It's gonna start doing the twitch. Alright, if you just wanna go to the place you want it to stop at, so I'm just gonna go right when it zooms out. And then you're gonna wanna click keyframe. You wanna go up one a previous or up a next frame. And then you're going to want to set it to zero. And then it should stop it from doing the twitch effect. Alright, see, it stopped it. Well, I'm going to show you how it looks whenever it does the twitch and whenever it stops. Alright, so it practically almost just got done with the rendering and then our RAM previewing, and this is what it's going to look like. Oh. I don't want to preview right now. Wait. It's only lagging because I have my um thing, the Camtasia up, and it really takes a lot out of my computer for some reason. But yeah, that's really pretty much it. Um, now you're just gonna want to file save or do whatever you want to do with it. And that's about it. Thanks to Irish Sniper for teaching me on how to do most of my effects. I'll link you down to his channel. I mean, he has some pretty good touch tuts. Probably way better than mine because I probably sound very boring and unprofessional, I guess. But this is my first tutorial, and once I get better, I'll try to redo it. That's all for I, that's all I have today. Please like uh share no yes yeah, share whatever and subscribe peace out guys peace out now